guys, my name is Hannah Love, and welcome to my channel. Um, this is my first time making a YouTube video, so this is very new to me, so please bear with me. Um, my whole idea behind my YouTube channel um, and plan for it is that I want to inspire and help others that are missing limbs. Um, as you can clearly see, I'm missing one. Um, and not only that, just inspire others as a whole. Um, and just giving you tips and life help and just a little bit of everything. Um, I don't want this video to be just directed at people missing limbs, but um, it might be most beneficial to them, but not directing it directly at them. Um, the way I lost my arm was my mom was pregnant with me and my umbilical cord wrapped around my arm. Um, I was doing a lot of flips and it wrapped around my arm and cut the circulation off. Um, so that's how that happened um, ever since I was really young um, I've been very driven and independent and so I've always wanted to do things myself and um, I don't know so I've taught myself how to do a lot of things like curl my hair paint my nails um, put my hair in a ponytail braid my hair fishtail my hair French braid my hair uh, a little bit of everything do my makeup everyday things they wouldn't think of like putting a water bottle lid on, like, I don't know, it, little things like that, um, that you just kind of have to adapt to and learn along the way, um, and so I just want to give some tips and things like that, and, um, I've learned a lot of things growing up like this, um, so I guess, and I'm very open to questions or things you want to see me do, um, I'm here to help you guys, so that's, the main goal behind this, um, as I said earlier. Um, so I just have felt lately like God put this on my heart to make this video and um, help you guys. So um, whatever you want to see me do, I'm open to showing you how I do it. Um, I want to be very open and honest, so that's my main thing. I'm going to be very open and honest um, through this whole time. I'm going to try and maybe start out with just making one video and then seeing how that goes and so on and so forth. Um, um, my main goal in life is to help others, so I felt like I could maybe do it through the YouTube channel um, since social media and internet things are so big in this day and age. Um, what I would like to do in my future is... Um, open or I made I want to major in um, business management and entrepreneurship um, and so I want to own my own business um, God hasn't exposed exactly what that is yet and so my ideas are very wide and open right now so I have huge dreams but um, I don't know God will show me where that will take me um, where he's taking me this far so um, the reason I got into that is, um, I went to a retreat held by Bethany Hamilton, which you don't, if you don't know who that is, it's, um, who the story is behind, um, or who the story is about, um, of Soul Surfer. So, um, she had that retreat and I, it is an amazing retreat and, um, if you have a missing limb and you're a girl and you want to know more about it let me know and I can give you details but um, anyways I learned a lot about myself then I it was a great confidence booster um, it was great being able to relate to so many other people like me um, but it a lot of the people had crazy stories that it just made me like about how they lost their limbs that it made me be way more thankful for what I do have instead of what I don't have and and so that was an amazing experience um, Every morning we would um, do these workouts and um, I learned so much about working out and like how important balance and breathing and like all of these factors that um, account into being having a healthy body and living a healthy lifestyle um, as someone missing a limb. And so I got really interested in that um, and before that, oh, sorry, I'm switching back and forth. I'm terrible at this but I'm just trying to tell a story 
Um, so I played soccer since I was six, and then I got to high school, um, or around middle school, and I started um, realizing that I had a greater passion for it than I maybe realized, and I started doing private training, and I got much better at it. Um, and so I wanted, I started thinking about going to college and all that, and um, my freshman year of high school, I was playing indoor co-ed, and I tore my right ACL. Um, and I did rehab and all that, and I was ready to get back. And um, then um, my first season back, I tore my left ACL. Um, a lot of the doctors and stuff said maybe it was one of the factors was my balance. And so um, some of it could have just been bad knees. I have bad knees in my family too. So it was a little bit of both maybe. We don't know for sure. But anyways, um, so when I... Uh, the year after I tore my second ACL, I was confused about what to do with my future. Um, I turned to a few things that um, weren't particularly the greatest. Um, anyways, um, besides that, that next year I went to the retreat and then that's when I figured all of that out and I wanted to do work on my balance for soccer. Well, I ended up playing my junior year then um, soccer and it just my knees were just killing me and I like I'm not someone that complains and it just was something that I wasn't enjoying like you don't want to do something that you love or it was hard um, dealing with some um, trying to do something that I loved but it was hurting me um, so I ended up not playing my senior year and I just kind of focused more on my health and my fitness and working on balance and stuff and so um, the thing I want to do is own my own gym. And so, um, sorry, that was a super long story. But yes, that's what I want to do. Um, so I can show you guys workout videos as well. I don't know, this is all up to you guys. So um, a thing that inspired me to do this was a little boy um, at a TJ Maxx store. He um, came up to me and, or his father came up to me and was like, hey, would you mind teaching my son how to tie his shoe? I saw that you had half an arm and just kind of assumed you knew. And so I was like, oh yeah, I can show him, and um, I showed him a few times, but he, like obviously you're not going to get it in a minute or five minutes, whatever. And so I gave him my number, I was like, please contact me if you want more help, like I'm very happy to help. Um, but he didn't, and it made me sad, but I want to help others like that. Like, I love teaching people, I love, like, things like that. And so, um, I have experience with it, and I want to help, so, um, this is kind of open for you guys, um. God, like I said earlier, God just put this on my heart to make this YouTube channel. I don't know what's going to happen with it, but um, I have faith in him that he would make me want to do this. And so, um, yeah, so just let me know. Um, comment. I don't really know how this works very well. Um, just let me know what you want me to do, what you want to see, um, how I can help you. Um, if you have any personal questions, contact me as well. Um, yeah, so sorry this was... A lot about me and I don't know um, I want to help you guys I want to show you guys um, I want this to be confidence boosting I want to help you in every way I can um, and so I want to give you guys advice so um, one way probably the next video I do will probably be whatever you guys want to see so if you want me to make a video of me tying my shoe doing my hair whatever. oh sorry that is my speaker <laughs> Uh, uh, sorry, my speaker makes an alarm sound when it's starting to die. Anyways, um, okay, I think that was maybe the alarm for me to stop talking. Um, so, thank you for watching. Um, comment, whatever you feel the need to. Um, yeah. I hope to hear back from you guys.